Hey guys, Hans here with Evo Gimbals. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this really cool mount that we got for a painter's pole. When you get it, it comes with an Allen key. There's a little tensioner screw right in here that you can see as you get this thing mounted up onto your painter's pole, you'll just tighten that tensioner and then it won't loosen up. You have a quarter 20 here. You take a painter's pole, I got a dirty old one here. This thing will get me a pretty good reach. I can get about eight feet with this one. You just simply screw this thing on here. You tighten the tensioner and screw, and then that way it won't come off just like that. And then you can put anything you want to on here. Um, give you an example. I got my GP Pro out here. I'm gonna go ahead and power that guy on. And now you can see that I can use this and get some really big jib moves, some really big dolly style moves. If I wanted to do like a swinging shot or follow somebody in through some bushes or something, it really gives you that versatility. This particular pole, you can buy these at Home Depot. It extends out so you can easily get about eight feet of extension with this one. They even have bigger ones that you can get more extension with. Another great accessory that goes with this is the clamp. So we can use our phone clamp here, put it on the end of the pole, be able to set up your phone so you could see up there what your camera is shooting. So this is just an old ratty one that you could get at Home Depot. You've got this amazing, great little tool for filming and getting really great shots, really cool, creative shots. The build on it, it's made out of aircraft aluminum. It's a quarter 20 on the top and it's just a simple painter's pull thread on the bottom. It changes the whole perspective on the way that you're shooting and it gives you a whole new dynamic of how you can get your shots. This will work with everything that we sell, um, the GP Pro to the SS to the Rage Gen 2, the Rage 3. It works across the board. It's just a standard quarter 20. You could just throw a camera on there if you wanted to, but it's never going to look as good as it does on a gimbal. So hopefully this video was helpful. And as always, if you guys have questions, reach out to us and don't forget to keep it smooth.